We're joined now by some very excited first responders. See how excited they are <laughs> <laughs> getting up so early. They are Rodney Tisdale from the fire department along with Tulsa police officer Josh Metcalf. And they're holding a basketball game tomorrow to benefit the Special Olympics of Oklahoma and Oklahoma firefighters burn camp. So how many years have you guys been doing this? This will be uh, actually our third annual uh, starting next Saturday. We've been playing against each other for Tulsa against fire for the last 13 or more. Oh, really? Yes. So okay. we just kind of made it official to have it start making an annual thing out of it. Is this really competitive, Josh? Is this like? Oh, it's extremely competitive. Uh, <laughs> nobody Not hates to lose. Serious, but, though. Um, yeah, it's yeah. all in good fun and, you know, it's a good game. Yeah, has the trash talking started, Rodney? Oh, yeah, it started. <laughs> most definitely. Who's I, the biggest trash talker? Tell us. I would probably say me. Oh, you? <laughs> no, no, I don't you know who. I'll get, I'll, Josh has to say, but we actually have fun. It's a, it's a good, healthy trash talking. Yeah. No axes or batons have been pulled out, of, so we're good. <laughs> That's always good, isn't it? Okay, it's going to happen tomorrow. You guys know how hot it is. I know right. you're prepared, though, because you, you work in this all day long. But what else is going to be happening at this event tomorrow? Well, um, it starts at 11 a.m. Right. And we will have bouncy used and different events for the kids, kind of like a carnival setting. We will have uh, different helicopters and things out there from the police department, and then also trucks from the fire department, things for the kids to do, DJs. And we'll be raffling off a lot of different tickets because we have tons of giveaways, oh, over $8,000 uh, worth of giveaways and uh, raffle prizes. And all the proceeds that you come out when you participate go to our uh, Special Olympic, Oklahoma, and then also our Oklahoma Firefighter Burn Camp. Yeah, we've done stories on both of those so they're throughout the years. And Josh, who else do you choose, or why do you choose these these organizations to help? Well, uh, law enforcement, Special Olympics go hand in hand. Uh, law enforcement officers, we're guardians of the flame. Uh, therefore, we do everything we can to raise money for these athletes so they're able to compete in uh, local games and USA games and world games. Yeah. So who's going to win? You guys have been practicing? I'm going to let him answer that. We don't practice. We just put like <laughs> this. Show up. Out of 13 years, I think we lost, what, once? I'm just uh, saying, you know. Just a game. Um, <laughs> I think last year, uh, police lost by maybe eight points or something like that. Oh. Oh. A loss is a loss, so, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, it's the <laughs> wrong column, isn't it? We're changing things up this year. So. Are you? Yeah, yeah. And Josh, you've got the height. Mm-hmm. How tall are you? Uh, about 6'9", six, 6'10". Six, yeah. So. yeah. It hasn't worked yet, though. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Is it easy to get uh, firefighters and, and officers involved in this? For us, it's a little difficult. List? It's a little difficult. We have a guys who love to play, um, but with our shift work and it right. being on B platoon, our guys are on vacation or they take off to make sure they're there for the game. Um, some, we try to work things out, but it's rough for us sometimes, yes. Yeah, yeah. Well, we are looking forward to it. And the game is at Christian Chapel, and that's located near 71st Memorial. Doors open at 11 a.m., and there are games, as uh, we said here this morning, for the kids before the game starts. Basketball game, though, begins at 1 p.m., right in the heat of the day, so you guys be careful. Mm -hmm. Tickets are $5 at the door, and they will have $5 food options for lunch. And there's going to be, as you heard, uh, lots of games and things going on, activities for the kids. So bring everybody, come out and watch that tomorrow. Thanks, guys, for being here. I appreciate you. Early and joining you. us. All right, Scott, back to you. I love